That's not meat, that's not animal products, that's vegan. Mexican bull, a Caucasian bull. Lamborghini SUV. You gotta move, you can't park there. I don't know if you can see all the details, probably not. Damn, they pulled somebody over on, on bicycles, dog. All right, so for today's vlog, I'm hungry. And I'm looking at the Hip City Veg, or Hip City Veg menu. And we're on their website, hipcityveg.com. And check it out. They're actually tempting me with some food. Like my stomach rumbling over here. I'm like, yo, that John look good. And then, bam! They hit you with these Johns. That's not meat, that's not animal products, that's vegan. And, they hit, and then they hit you with, yo, go, 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 where'd it go? They, they stole it. Yo, why they do that? What's up with the website? What, oh, it's probably lefty, loosey, righty, tighty. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah, look at it. Wow, that looks good. That's called the disco chicken. Oh, snap, and that's called the hip city, what? Hip city, crispy, what? Crispy hip city ranch. All right, and what else? What else they got? And uh, what's the name of that John? All right, well, anyway. We already tried this John before. Crispy Hip City Ranch. That's the one we already tried. That came with battered chicken, lettuce, tomatoes, onions, pickles, and peppercorn ranch. This I've never tried, and it's looking really good right now. Chipotle fajita wrap made with blackened chicken. That chicken is not real chicken onion, pepper, tortilla, cabbage, pico de gallo, avocado, and chipotle crema, or crema, right? That sounds right. I hope that cream not white. That John sound all right. Next, they got this over here, the disco chicken. I tried that before and I did not like that. That smoke temper is like a gigantic, I think it's like a mushroom or something. It was really mushy. These John's looking popping right now. Little golden nugs, and that's made with organic grains and served with sweetened potato fries. So we about to go see what these things taste like. All right, now we can get the vlog started. On today's show, we have your boy, Toon Dollars, operating a motor vehicle driving through the city of Philadelphia. We need to clean these windows because, like, we could show the outside, but it's so dirty and like Windex can come in handy. So Windex and some newspaper, I gotta do a whole vlog with just that. Windex and newspaper your windows, that work like magic. They make your windows look brand new. It's crazy how they made this little avenue right here look compared to what it used to look like. Cause it, it didn't always look like this. That was a big lot right there, an empty lot where the convention center was at. That wasn't there. It was a lot and you would park there to go to your probation officer over there or go where anywhere else was at over here. Come on, y'all. This is gonna be Thanksgiving and all the Black Friday sales are gonna go away. <laughs> Yo, they don't know when to make a left. The A loft. Meet me at a loft. Yeah, which which one? A loft. But which what which loft? A loft! A loft! That's the name of the loft! <laughs> they get mad. Yo, dog. Yo, point at that right there. Let's point this out. I noticed that there's four minorities behind those bars, those those windows simulate bars. And there's one, two, three, and four of them. Why aren't there like an Asian bull, a Mexican bull, a Caucasian bull, and an African-American bull? Why are they all four African-American bulls? You know what I mean? Like that's, that, I, don't, I don't know. I hope they're not trying to, you know what I mean? Cause it, it appeared those those windows simulate bars to me. So I'm, so I'm just saying. You know what I mean? It should have been more multicultural. Where, where, you know what I mean? Throw Hindu in there. We all chilling, squad, squad D. Like, you know what I mean? Hello, buddy. <laughs> it's not a funny joke. That's a horrible joke. Gotta do a whole vlog on how to purchase Windex. Say no. <laughs> Yo, what vlog are we on? What vlog is this? 325. Wow, we're gonna go to Hip City Veg and eat some vegan food on 325. Yo, it's 325, right? Yeah, 325. Yesterday was 324. I lose track. Look at that Lamborghini, record that Lamborghini SUV. Yo! Who trying to show off with a Lamborghini SUV though? Yo, who really trying to show off? Why though? Why do you gotta do that? <laughs> and, I'm, and I'm in the soccer mom van, come on man. Yo, but my man had a, or a woman, whoever was operating that vehicle, blah, 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 blah. That vehicular device. Come on, dog. You in a BMW and you throwing your flashies? Point at him. He throwing his flashies, so he gonna go on YouTube too. 
Go ahead, man. Park up. Do, do, do. Go ahead. Park up, dog. Damn, it turned yellow and all. It's your fault. You the people that be holding the world up. It's an old man. Come on, dog. You like 60. Somebody out there is like, yo, I'm 60. I'm not old. I mean, you're not that old. He's he's young. He's a young teenager. No, he's more like 70 or shit. No. <laughs> no, he wasn't 70, but still. Anyway, back to the conversation. My guy had a Lamborghini SUV. A traditional Lamborghini goes for what, quarter of a million, half a million dollars? I wonder what one of those things go for. We can probably Google it and put the cost right here, thanks to technology. Come on, dog. I'm not selling my YouTube show. All right, I'm about to bang this right. Go ahead, un derecha in la calle Cruz. Si, swiping, no swiping. It's crazy because when you work for Lyft, they give you that little Lyft um, box, light box, and you see a lot of little light boxes go by. That's crazy. It looks like kind of like a, a game simulation. What if like a robber rocked the Lyft box? He didn't even work for Lyft. He just had a Lyft box and he used it on his vehicle, and that automatically is made to deter the the crime investigation because they're automatically gonna say the person who robbed me had Lyft on his job. <laughs> so they're gonna look up everybody in Lyft. They're gonna waste all this time on the real bull who robbed him getting away. He gonna throw away the little Lyft junk because he never even worked for Lyft. He, he stole that junk, that junk. He broke into a car. I don't know, he bought that junk on eBay. And yeah, that's gonna be crazy. All right, where the food at, man? I feel like we never gonna get there. Bam, we made it. Yeah, we finally made it. And we got VIP parking out front. We got $2 parking right out front, dog. Yeah, we got $2 parking. Yeah, two, two, got a parking. Yeah, two, got a parking. Parking like a grandma with a seatbelt on. So, uh, safety first. Woohoo! Made it. Thing is, I didn't call this thing in. So, I'm gonna have to go manually order it. And I'm gonna have to wait here, like sitting ducks. Hopefully, they don't come and try to give me a ticket. Like, you got to move. You can't park there. Like, come on, dog. I'm vegan. You gotta give me a break. Like, this is their parking, dog. It's right in front of their business. You can't kick their customers out. Introduce a vlog and say, All right, seriously. Oh, snap, what just fell? Yo, they gave me like a little dip. What is this? Is that that little sriracha dip? She, yo, she said, What you want, this or something else? And I'm like, Uh, give me the one that's that spicy. <laughs> oh, snap, it smells like cheese. Whoa, that's that's crazy. I don't know, maybe that's for the wrap, right? No, that's probably for the nuggets because the nuggets need a little dip. All right, so we got two things. We got the golden nugs, and then, or the little nugs, some type of nugs. What else came with it, let me see. Oh, snap, and the little uh, sweet potato fries. Yo, two don't even like sweet potatoes. I'm gonna be dead up with y'all. I don't eat sweet potatoes, I'm not a big fan of them. But guess what, I'm vegan and I'm willing to try anything. Can you see this in the light? Why them little fake nuggets look like they're not even fully cooked? Yeah, they got all this like bread crust crumbing on it. Look at that, that joint come right off. Yo, what's up with that? That joint just, just broke on me. Yo, what's up with that? What is this? Anyway, let's 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 not get into that yet. First thing that we're gonna get into is this joint right here. This is a Chipotle fajita. Alright, so check it out. Look, I don't know if you can see all the details, probably not. But to me, it looks like a pretty standard wrap. Smells pretty good. The cheese doesn't look fully melted, but overall, I mean, the smells up my nose here. <laughs> Let me give the camera operator a nice little, so she can get her little dig on. Thank you. And I'm about to take a bite and let y'all know what I think. Oh man, it's falling apart. Wow, this is like some fake meat right here. This is fake chicken. Yo, that's crazy. I think I'm about to put that John in there. What am I talking about? Ready? I'm about to take a bite. Mm. Mm. 
This John slamming me. Yo, this John is crazy. Wow. Tastes powerful too. Like the flavor, it got a lot of flavor. Whatever they use, MSG, I don't know what they use. Salt, pepper, ketchup, I don't know. This John got taste though. Oh, the pico de gallo got some flavor. And then they, oh, they put um, avocados. In. Yo, this John is crazy. Let me, let me take another, it's, it's so small though. But this John is crazy, let me get another bite. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. I taste the wrap. The wrap is really flavorful. I taste all the mushy ingredients, and I don't really like mush. Y'all know how I feel about mush. If you don't know how I feel about mush, go watch my OCD vlog. I did a whole vlog on my food OCD. Well, the mush in this isn't that bad. Everything else has the right texturity or density to blend it out and mellows it out. It's not too much mush. It's just like the right amount of mush. It got the onions. It got the, the peppers, tomatoes. I really like all the textures. The textures aren't bad. I think this is like, what's that? Like a mushroom or something? I don't know what's in this. All I know, uh, it's good. I'm about to take another bite and then I'm gonna work on them little nuggets next because I don't want this junk to disappear. This is something that you want to save so you can have that last bite, that last flavor, you know what I mean? <laughs> mm. This is crazy. No animal products, this is banging. I wish this was like right up the block from the Crizzle because I'd probably be eating this more. It's just so far, y'all come to Center City like or Broad Street. I think they got like three or four locations in Philly, but for me, they're all like, not that far, but like far enough. Damn, they pulling somebody over on, on bicycles, dog. I just watched them. Yo, two, two cops just pulled somebody over on bikes. Get out of town. Damn, we done seen a Lamborghini SUV and cops pull people over on bikes today? I done seen it all in one day, yo. I'm telling you. Yo, check that out. Yo, they jumped out on them like SWAT. I'm like, yo, they on bikes, though. I'm over here eating. <laughs> Y'all see me, I'm fat. I'm over here with gloves just picking up the onions. But yo, that's crazy. All right, that's it. I was supposed to put this down a long time ago. Next up. It's going to be the little fake nuggets and the french fries. So what should we try first? Nuggets and french fries. French fries and nuggets. Let's try the french fries. These are sweet potato fries. Here after you, you can have one. There you go. Now I'm going to try one. Let's see. Ready? This is a sweet potato french fry. First things first, it's freaking um, like wet. Like I already see it off the back. It's greasy. And it's pretty soft and soggy. I don't know about that. It smells like a french fry, it doesn't smell bad. Let's see. That's weird, I was confused. It was crunchy on the outside. I liked it, the outside was nice and crunchy. But the inside, here you go, try another one. But the inside was kind of like mushy, like to an extreme, like a wet mush. Cause they're really soggy. Let me grab one that's not soggy. Yeah, they are really soggy. And you guys can't see my gloves, but my gloves where I touch the fries at are soaked. Um, I guess, I don't know. They're not bad. They're just not something I would eat every day, but they're not bad. They're not bad at all. Here, you, you wanna know them? I actually like them, but I just wouldn't eat them every day. Hey, check it out, check it out, watch it out, make it disappear. You know what it kind of remind me of? Like a fake checker french fry. Cause there's not many french fry companies that come up with like a breaded or like spiced french fry like this. And it got flavor. It just, the aftertaste you could taste that it's a sweet potato. You could taste, and you gotta be a sweet potato fan. I guess if you're a sweet potato fan, then these Johns is popping to you. They're like, yo, let me try them Johns. But if you don't like sweet potatoes that much, I would say give them a try because I don't really like sweet potatoes that much and they don't taste bad. They taste pretty good. Let me let me try one last one before I get to the little nugget. I mean, that John disappear. <laughs> it's so greasy. It reminds me of like a, like, like a breakfast stick. What's that called? Oh, uh, uh, a French toast stick. Seriously, so soggy and greasy. 
All right, next up is going to be one of these little fake little nugget things. Let me bring it in half. Check, check out the little density. Check out the little density. Yeah. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to break it right here. Oh, snap. And then break evenly so y'all can see what the inside look like. That's not real meat. I'm sorry about the lighting. We are in a vehicle. We're doing this joint out on the road. But look at it. It's not meat. Here, try your piece. I'm, I'm going to try a piece. I'm going to try plain before I do any dip. I'm going to take a little bite plain. Watch this. Um, microwave dinner. This feels like a trivia um, pop quiz when I eat this. <laughs> microwave dinner. That's what it tastes like. Like a microwave little cheap dinner. That's what it tastes like. Like, like, like some microwave nuggets. Yo, what's up with them girls swinging sticks? Yo, I'm seeing it all today, dog. What is up with that? Why y'all? Yo, yo, yo. What are they doing? Yo, it, it's not gonna get any more stranger than this. The the building they stand in front of the name is strange. Sonesta. What the what is that? Sonesta. Yo, this is surreal. All right, back to the show. So check this out. Now I'm about to take it and dip it because by itself. Let me give you one more little bite by itself. Super duper soft, no salt, no pepper. It doesn't really have much flavor. The outside is crunchy, but it doesn't have much flavor. Let's see if the sauce is supposed to give it the flavor. I think that's why they give us the sauce because they know it's plain. <laughs> nice flavor, but the dang little nugget is way too soft for like for me. Just my personal opinion. It's pretty soft. Here you go. You could dip if you want to take a little, you know what I mean? Little little dip. Yeah. The soft saves it. Can I eat these all the time? It's probably not. Once in a while. They're not bad though. Again, I guess as a vegan, it gives you some variation so you can try different textures and stuff. The sauce got flavor. The sauce ain't bad. It gives a nice little spice. Yeah, not a bad sauce. You know what? You want to you dip? You want to be smart? Take one of these these little sweet potato johns and just dip it and see what it tastes like. Let me see what it tastes like. Ew, custom, watch this. Yo, 10 times better. What? These johns is popping with them, yo. What? There you go. Watch this. Mmm. It's the sauce. <laughs> the sauce is crazy. Some top secret sauce. You want one dipped? Here. Here you go. Bam. Take a dip john. The dip johns is banging. The dip johns tastes 10 times better than with it by itself. I mean, it tastes pretty good by itself. Which one do I like more out of the nuggets or these fries? I would say the fries. The nuggets ain't bad, but they just too soft. Like, all this is soft. Maybe I should have told them like crispy or well done. It's not bad though. Yeah, so out of everything, out of the wrap, the fries and the fake nuggets, I would say the wrap will go first, number one. The fries will go number two. And the little nuggets will go number three. All right, so it's 7.42 and we're on our way to Hip City Reg. About to go try some of that chicken, some of that fake chicken, some of that fake chicken. 